Hello children, so welcome to AIMS India's online classes today from physics subject fundamentals of physics topic we are going to discuss. So okay, children, so our today's concept physics and its scope, physics and its scope. So the word physics is taken from the Greek word physikos which means natural means it is the science of nature in a broader sense the science about nature is called physics according to the word physicos so physics study the behavior and interaction of matter and force matter and force so you know about matter children we have matter in different forms solids liquid gases so physics in physics we study about matter and the force acting between the matter different forms of matter suppose if you observe this if you observe this so this is an atomic model so there so many atoms are there so many molecules are there so they will be moving in some orbits so they will move like that because of some forces studying about this atom and studying about the forces which are making them move around the in the orbits is called physics is called physics so here two particles here two particles they are moving away from one another two objects or two atoms they are moving away from one another so what is the force behind them studying that is called physics or or here we have a magnet here we have a magnet which is rotating or which is um, oscillating this side and that side along with the magnet this ball also moving or oscillating this side and that side so because of what force they are oscillating here magnet is a matter their oscillation is because of some force or here due to gravitational force the apple is falling down so studying about the apple and the force is called physics so in physics we study about matter and we study about force okay, next so the laws of physics are generally expressed as mathematical relations like E equal to mc square. So where E is energy, m is mass, c is speed of light, they, they are combined. This energy, mass, speed of light, these all physics quantities combined with the help of equality sign like a mathematical relation, like a mathematical relation. So the laws of physics are generally expressed using mathematical relations. So the branch of physics can be defined as study of matter and energy means the branch of science, the branch of science which deals with the matter and the energy is called branch of physics. So physics is the study of matter means mainly in physics we study about the substance from which this whole universe is made and how it relates to different forms of energy in the nature. So mainly about that the physics will study. So this is the universe, how this universe is formed or in this universe how these planets are formed, how these planets are revolving around the sun in different orbits studying about that is called physics and in the universe why there are different forms of energy like sound energy light energy heat energy why we have different forms of energy studying about that is called physics so studies about matter and energy matter and energy so next matter so what is matter matter is that which occupies space and which possesses mass means it should have some mass and it should 
occupy some space like this. So then it is called as a matter. So it can be a book or it can be a chair or it can be a glass or table, anything which occupies space and which has some mass is called matter. Next, what is energy? So energy cannot be seen. It could be felt only. So for example, you are listening some songs with the help of your this uh, headphones. Can you see that song? Just you can feel the song. You can feel the song and you can tell the song is very nice. It's uh, melodious or it's a rap song or it's a disco song. So like that, you can name the type of song or you can feel the song. You can enjoy by listening the song, but you cannot see the song because here sound, this sound is a form of energy which can which we can feel but not see, but cannot see. Or from the sun, heat energy. From the sun, heat energy will come. So it will come to the solar, solar, solar panel. The solar panel will convert heat energy to electricity. Heat energy to electricity, electrical energy. Because of that charging, charging will happen. So our battery, we can supply to battery. From that, we can send to one bulb, light bulb. So from here, light energy. Light energy is coming out. This heat energy, electricity or light energy or battery chemical energy, all these are different forms of energies which we can just feel, which we can just feel, okay. So for example, electricity, light, sound, heat, etc. So energy means capacity of doing a work. Capacity of doing a work is called energy. So next. So physics is mainly classified into two types. One is matter, another one is energy. In matter, again, we have mainly three forms, solids, liquids, gases, and one more state. Plasma state also is there, which you can learn in your higher classes. Solid means the molecules are closely packed. It's a solid. The molecules are somewhat loosely packed. Liquid, if the molecules are very loosely packed, then it is a gas. So the molecular composition is different in three forms. So like that we have three kinds of matter. <coughs> so energy means we have mechanical energy, means here the fan is rotating. So the rotating means it will be having mechanical energy, light energy coming from sun, sound energy. So in your house, if you plug one TV or music system here, so then from that you can listen sound energy, electrical energy. So here solar panel is there, the sunlight coming to solar panel turning it into electrical energy. Because of that all the fans and refrigerator are moving. Nuclear energy means which is used in bo making bombs or making or destroying atoms. For that purpose we can make use of nuclear energy. Okay, like this we have different forms of energies. So branches of physics. So physics, it emerged as a separate science only in the 19th century. So until 19th century, the physicist, physicist was often also a mathematician, also a philosopher, also a chemist biologist, engineer, artist. Like that, along with physics, he might be having grip on so many other subjects. But until 19th century, we use them to name them as mathematicians, philosophers, chemists like that. But in 19th century, this physics emerged as a separate science and uh, um, from then onwards, we we, we call that uh, scientists who are studying about physics, we call we used to call them as physicists, like that.
so today the field has grown the physics field has grown to such an extent for its systematic study the subject is subdivided into various branches so it became so vast that this uh, one branch physics branch again subdivided into so many branches like mechanics heat thermodynamics light sound electricity magnetism modern physics electronics like that so many branches of physics were evolved there are some more few other branches like meteorology astronomy geophysics biophysics which you will learn in, in your higher classes so physics in daily life so the advanced advancement in physics has enabled us to improve our daily life so applications of physics has an impact almost every aspect of our of our daily life means the whatever discoveries they have made in physics they have affected our everyday life in a great manner by inventing thousands of missions so from the moment we wake up in the morning till we go to the bed at night it is quite difficult to put them in a list put them in a list okay from morning to night we we will be making use of so many different kinds of missions which are the inventions of physics so let, let's see some of them so in health and medicine so how we are using physics in health and medicine medicine for uh, taking x rays if uh, while playing games if you fell down so you will be taken to the doctor there he will take one x ray he will check your bones and he will tell he will tell whether your uh, hand is fractured or not sonography or ct scan like this your body will go into one mission totally your body will be scanned in the mission ct scan or we can call it as mri or mri mri scan this all words you can learn let, later children so the brain scanning can be done with ct scan or mri so these are this uh, our stethoscope for checking um, our heartbeat for thermometer for checking our temperature ecg it is also heartbeat like that like that in medicine field in health and medicine medicine field so many missions because of physics were invented which were used by doctors so with the help of these missions they can diagnose disease we are affected with what disease and they can give proper treatment to us proper treatment to us or transport so cars buses trains aeroplanes mopeds all these transport vehicles are invented invented and the world is becoming smaller reducing traveling time because of all these things suppose uh, uh with the aeroplane from hyderabad to bangalore within one hour we can reach bangalore means they are making the world smaller they are making the time traveling time uh, very very less so that we can reach any part of the world in less time our communication communication the uh, physics has invented telephones telegraph previously there were uh, telegraph telegraph for sending messages in the olden days with the advancement of physics they have invented telegraph telephones mobile phones in satellites internet satellites internet now we are able to see tv programs only because of the satellite satellite so digital cinema we are able to see because of the satellite so in uh, in the field of communication also physics has uh, done a great job by inventing different kinds of machines so household appliances and gadgets electric bulbs tubes fans refrigerator like this 
washing machines like this geyser heater so all these things which were invented by physics they are making our life comfortable they are making our life comfortable next energy production energy production in the field of energy production solar energy with the help of solar panels wind energy with the help of wind vanes tidal energy with the help of water because of dams atomic energy with the help of this uh, nuclear fission or fusion atomic energy so with all these uh, techniques with the adv advancement of all these machines we are replacing conventional sources of energy in the olden days the energy was only fuel fuel like kerosene or wood wood kerosene wood kerosene sunlight they were the olden olden days uh, traditional sources of energy now we we are replacing with them solar panels wind vanes nuclear energies like that so in the field of energy production also physics has invented so many types of machines dress materials so different types of fashionable comfortable dresses are produced by the machines developed by the physicists and engineers so leather jacket in winter leather jacket or during uh, rain during rainy season uh, rain coats or during summer season formal cotton shirts for attending meetings suit for casual wear t-shirts or this uh, sleeveless jackets overcoats rain coats skirt normal dress polo shirt night gowns shorts like this so many different types of fashionable comfortable dresses are produced by the physicists next in the field of entertainment entertainment also cinema cinematography cinematography with the help of video camera we are shooting the cinema radio tv video games music systems vcds these are all sources or machines developed by the physicists like mics camera this is a, a tv channel van tv channel van so tv television television laptop headphones mobile phone joystick for playing games remote for controlling tv like this in the field of entertainment also physics has developed so many different kinds of machines so not only for that even for scientific research what is there in the sky what is there behind the sun or how many kinds of earth are there how many kinds of uh, planets are there like earth in our universe this all we can search with the help of telescopes with the help of telescopes some crores miles or kilometers we can observe with the help of telescopes and we can find out what is there in the universe or we can find the secrets in the universe or with the help of microscope we can observe viruses bacteria or even plants parts of plants what is there inside the flower what is there inside the fruit all we can find with the help of microscope means these are all developed with the principles of physics and they are utilized for research in different branches of science so these are all these are microscope telescope mobile phone satellite washing machine camera music system television air conditioner computer mp3 player these are all the inventions of science especially physics which will make our life comfortable and enjoyable like that okay children okay children what we have learned today 
so we learned about physics and its scope children so physics means we study about matter and force so physics physics uh, laws of physics related by mathematical relations it studies about universe it studies about energy so matter means anything which occupies space which possesses mass like book chair table glass energy means which cannot be seen which can be only felt electricity light sound heat energy can be defined as capacity of doing work physics mainly divided into two types matter energy matter means it is again divided into solids liquid gases energy means we have different forms of forms of energy mechanical light sound electrical nuclear so branches of physics in the olden days physics was used to uh, combined with other subjects mathematics philosophy chemistry biology but later it was from 19th century it was treated as separate science and again it has grown it has taken growth in such an extent that again they have divided physics into branches mechanics heat and thermodynamics light sound electricity like that so in our daily life from morning to until we go to bed we are making use of so many different kinds of machines which were invented by the physicists and which are making our life comfortable so in health and medicine x ray sonography ct scan mri ecg thermometer different machines they have invented which are used to diagnose the diseases transport car bus train aeroplane bike so many vehicles are invented which will reduce the traveling time so regarding communication field also apart from telegraph telephone is invented next mobile phone is invented satellite internet is invented household appliances washing machines geyser heater refrigerator fans tubes invented energy production solar energy wind energy tidal energy atomic energy different forms of energy which are called conventional sources of energy means means which will replace old and days traditional sources of energy because this wood coal after some day some days they will become exhausted the reserves will be completed so we have to search for new sources of energy always dress materials different kinds of dress materials for design which are suitable for different seasons or different occasions entertainment so many machines are invented like tv radio cinematography video games to give us entertainment so still for researching what is there in the universe about macro macro elements which are very 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 big or which are at larger distances micro which are microscopic very 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 small we cannot see with our naked eye for observing that micro objects also they have invented telescope microscope and other instruments to identify the principles of physics and they have done they are doing so much research in different branches of science okay children that's all for today thank you for watching our video please subscribe our channel and press the bell icon for receiving latest updates thank you have a good day